One of the best, you got the best number one podcast on YouTube, forward slash, triple R segment at seven. It's pretty much the greatest thing out here, agreed by us and by the fans, yes indeed. I'm Mike, and with almost all of our crew here, we'll be doing the same ground when the hell we feel like it, right? Pretty much. All right, I'm Mike. <laughs> I'm Mike, sitting right over here with our crazy man, GBK. Hola. And sitting right over here is my girl, Holly Wood. Hey, y'all. And we are Mike. In the crew. In the morning. In the morning. Even, the morning. even, though, it's, <laughs> <laughs> even though it's like five in the afternoon, so I'm Mike and the crew in the morning. Nine in the afternoon. What? <laughs> I had to do it. Wow. Okay, who who actually sings that song? Um, oh, oh my gosh, I know the. I know, uh, I've, I was, I've heard that song before too. I want to say Panic at the Disco, but I'm probably wrong. Was it cheeseburgers? Cheese, but cheeseburgers are not wrong. Cheeseburgers are actually no, like cheeseburgers should be wrong with they're from McDonald's. McDonald's never has good food though. Their fries are good. Their fries are except, good. Except their fries. Their fries but are. That's it. <laughs> their fries are mediocre at best. Whenever we go to McDonald's, I'm like, can I have a McFlurry? Uh. Our machine is broken. But we'll give you some free fries. But well, we give you some fries. I was like, I don't want no freaking fries. I want a freaking McFlurry. <laughs> <laughs> you get in there, you fix it. Last time I had a McFlurry, they didn't put a whole lot of ice cream in it, so I had like a McOreo. <laughs> a McOreo. I had. Oh, so, so was it? Uh, was it was it McFlurry? Or was it just like ice cream with Oreos in it? It was a, it, it was, was an Oreo, Oreo with ice cream on it. Oh, it was an Oreo with ice cream on it. <laughs> It's an Oreo McFlurry, but I they didn't apparently didn't have a lot of ice cream, so it ended up literally being a McOreo. 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 Hey. This is like a, a superstar, an actor. Like, my name is Robin McOreo. <laughs> <laughs> my name is Robin McOreo. We should make that a new character. Introducing Robin McOreo, nominee for best performance in the McFlurry. The Mc- no, <laughs> yeah. best performance in the McOreo. The McOreo. <laughs> <laughs> you see the connection Pete there? Apple for its performance in the, the candy, candy store. store. <laughs> candy store. <laughs> That's funny. Anyway, um, welcome to episode 16 of Mike and the Crew in the Morning. And um, oh, and as you can see, we're going all new high tech. And so writing down a piece of paper, we actually have a little notepad on my uh, iPhone here. I don't think yeah. they can see it. But yeah, well, no, every, y'all, y- y'all know what the iPhone 4 is. Y'all know it has that notepad app on there. So it's, you know, awesome. Or my personal favorite comment to the iPhone 4, i, I 4. Ooh. <laughs> 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 and we will have to bleep that out during the editing process. <laughs> hey, Bill thank and, you. Say thank you to Halloween Horror Nights for that. Uh, one. Bill, and, Bill and Ted joke, very, very cool. <laughs> <laughs> I still did <they're> mine. <laughs> 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 oh my! And that, that's from the uh, Mummy, isn't it? Yeah. Well, on Danny's was, squeaky setting. <laughs> I, was, I was like one day writing through the Mummy, and I was just like, oh, I love the love the the um, audio. And then the car, I was like, hey guys, what if the mummy was all cutified? <laughs> or at least the voice. Silence! <laughs> With your song, I will rule for all eternity! <laughs> I would pay to go on the ride if, they, if they did that. And then flowers come flying out. And then, yeah, instead of where the giant the giant soldier mummies come in and attack you, giant bursts of flowers shoot up at you, but they're, and there's but they're dead flowers. And bunnies. Uh, like, and yeah, evil, e- but they're evil bunnies. <laughs> No, it, it looks like the uh, bunny from the Happy Bunny posters. Happy Bunny. <laughs> Happy Bunny zombie soldiers. Well, as you can see, GBK and Mike have clearly reached new levels of wacko. Insanity. There you go. Insane <laughs> in the membrane. Insane. Got no brain. No. Yeah, we know that you don't. Y'all saw Dickie Roberts? Ooh. Ooh. Y'all saw Dickie Roberts? <laughs> no. Okay, don't well, care. that's what that's wrong. No, I don't know. What you talking about, fool? <laughs> <laughs> what you talking about, Willis? What you talking about, Willis? <laughs> that was actually a really good show, though. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, too bad Gary Coleman died. Rest in peace to Gary Coleman. <laughs> what are you doing? Gary Coleman is dead. Yeah, you didn't know that? What are you talking about, Willis? <laughs> I mean, I knew. I mean, I didn't know a lot, but whatever. That's kind of sad, though. He died from the disease that he had. The short disease? Wow! I don't know what it's called. That's not That's nice. That's terrible. That it was some what, sort. What's it, it called? Was some for, I don't exactly know. It was Michael some form of very... dwarfism. Did uh, Emmanuel Lewis have the same thing, or was he just short? Who? Webster. I don't know. Who? Who's Emmanuel. Webster? Emmanuel Lewis. Who? He was also short, like Gary Coleman. Who? Butterbean cheesecake. What? What? 
Okay, never mind. <laughs> look it up. Look it up on you. Look it up on YouTube. Yeah, I'll do that. Which means that I probably won't. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> Pretty much. Anyway, coming up on today's episode, we got a few different things. Um, we're gonna do some different. We're gonna be doing, you know, the Would You Rather. We're gonna do the open mic, uh, story time, the CSI game, which we haven't done Stripper in a while. The cake. What? What? Huh? Why did you say? Okay, did you just utter the phrase "stripper and a cake"? Yes, I did. Why? Because we're gonna have a stripper and a cake. Where's the cake? Where's the stripper? <laughs> it comes later. Yeah, pretty much. You didn't know this. You didn't know this. Get we... with it. You're the creator of the show. What the heck's going on at Brain Eaters? The, he, I. This is the first time hearing about stripper and a cake. I'm gonna dude. open this brain. This is the sound it's gonna make. <laughs> Y'all are just being all mean to me today. What the hell's going on? When aren't we mean to you? I know. <laughs> well, you're being especially mean to me right now. I mean, I'm, I'm just saying. Especially. I said especially. <laughs> especially. Especially. Shut up. Y'all are mean. <laughs> you don't tell your girlfriend to shut up. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Whatever. <laughs> Wield that axe, girl. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so these were all... All right, so these were all new sound drops that I took from another episode. Oh dear God! Okay, so I think no, this is from my this is from our Cinco de Mayo episode. So you're agreeing that your porno name is Perv Master Twenty Five? No. <laughs> no. Okay, this is okay, and here's uh, here's all the new ones. <laughs> that was me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one is GBK. My name is Slim Jim. <laughs> <laughs> Jim that is was still coming on the show. That was I, all. I have to. I have to arrange that. <laughs> okay. Um. This one is uh, Hollywood. Don't sit there like a freaking mum chant. Okay. Please exclaim. Ex exclaim. <laughs> <laughs> Explain what is a mum chant. It was a saying that my great grandmother made up. It would. It could be used to describe a whole lot of things, but essentially, what she would use it for was before she actually like couldn't talk anymore. She would when she would try to get something out of you, like. You couldn't tell her, like, you were so excited about something, but it was, you were just like, and you couldn't explain it. She would be like, well, don't sit there like a mom chan. Tell me what's going on. So it means don't sit there with your mouth closed if you want to tell me something. Uh, that's what a mom chant is. Okay. A mom chant. A mom chant. That could be a character. My name is mom chant. No, <laughs> no, that's okay. mine. Sorry. Okay, so, okay, this one is GBK. She can't handle the Oralisha. <laughs> <laughs> this one's also GBK. I got to get my neurals did. <laughs> <laughs> neurals did. Neurals. <laughs> that's like that's like the ghetto woman at the nail salon. Oh yeah, with the long nails with the like you know the different the huge old that, are, that like would literally claws. be called nails. Yeah. <laughs> they're, and, they're and they're hanging out and hanging out like this long. They, and can, they like, have like all those diamonds and art work. They could like it's a freaking. They could like bear. <laughs> they could like bear scratch your eyes out. Okay, this one's GBK. It's for a dollar, find your penis. <laughs> <laughs> You want to explain that one? Uh, that is actually a quote from Family Guy. Oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> Stewie goes into this group of fat dudes. Like, um, it's um, Peter started this coalition for fat guys, and Stewie's like, "Why don't you for a dollar?" Oh, okay, okay, I get it. <laughs> okay. All right, this one's GBK. I will be skinny. <laughs> <laughs> and you are skinny. <laughs> <laughs> I will be skinny. <laughs> that helps all the time, you know. Okay. <laughs> okay. This one is also GBK. I just want to take a permanent nap, guys. <laughs> Do you have like a death wish or something? No, there's a story behind that. Actually, I was talking to my friend Christina, no relation to the other one. Um, not, and she was not, not, no, not beastie. No. Okay. And she was like, oh, we're watching this video once, you know, the anti-suicide video. And we're like, oh. Anti-suicide video. And she's video. like laughing. I was like, that's terrible. She's like, no, no. It, it's sad, but the the phrase is funny. It's like this dude was like, how to look for signs of suicide. And it was like, guys, I feel like I want to commit suicide. Like, what? And then the <laughs> other one was, I just want to take a permanent nap, guys. And I was like. Using it, mine. Okay, here's the last three new ones. We have this one's also GBK. I want to see my safe in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see my safe or what's that see, supposed to be? I was gonna say myself, but I said safe. I'll see <laughs> my. You should, you should just say safe and self at the same time, so it's not being safe. Safe, safe, safe. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, this God. one's this one's GBK. The hose on the ground. 
<laughs> that was only half of it. Let me play the whole thing. The hose on the ground, I'll throw it all down. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I have no idea when I said that. The hose on the ground, I'll throw it all down. <laughs> no, I don't even know. And this one, last one is GBK. <laughs> when did I do that? Oh my goodness. I think it was like halfway through the episode. Um, the Other. previous episode. Yeah. You, you messed up saying something and you were just like frustrated so you're like yeah, yeah, yeah. well no he was, he was more like <laughs> I can't copy him it was awesome Wow. <laughs> wow, okay. That's uh, brilliant. Now that they lie. know about all of our random little sound drops. Sound drops. 113. That's, uh, I like that Holy Freezeburger. <laughs> Freezeburger? <laughs> Freezeburger. But 113 sound drops, yeah. New record. High score. Woo. Level up. <laughs> that was from, um,. Oh, uh, episode seven when we had the "Would you rather" question about would you rather? Would, it was like, oh, yeah, yeah. It was like, would you yeah. rather have your uh, love life scored by an air, uh, air supply soundtrack, or would or would you rather have female sounds go off during intercourse? Ding 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 ding! Multi ball. Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> and like, oh my! Oh uh, my! <laughs> Master Johnson. I thought it was chickens. I changed it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. Well, that's anyway. A, now so, that they all um, know that we're all completely insane. All right, so I didn't know that from the first episode. I mean, ugh. you're uh, messed up. Okay, um, we have something cool coming up. Well, not cool, but everyone's been talking about it. But we're not going to introduce it. Yet. We're going to introduce it when the segment comes up for the open mic segment. But we are going to go into a break. But we will be back. And where to go? All right, here. <laughs> uh, fail. <laughs> like failure. Spirit. All right, but we'll be back. You're listening to Mike and the crew in the morning. I remember meeting this guy this one time. You keep jerking my chain. He told me he was starting up this band and how awesome it was going to be. By the grace of God, I'm still here. He told me it was going to be like a southern rock country crossover kind of deal. Didn't plan on living this long. We've seen him perform live over at the band's brew and barbecue event, and I gotta tell you. There ain't a beating heart that ain't been broke. Love's like a rodeo. Billy Big Knight and the Soul Stars Cowboys. They sure can rock it out. With the soul the crew in the Only at youtube.com forward slash bar segment seven. Hey guys, Mike here from Mike and the Crew in the Morning. And you know, if you want to go to a place where you can see some sports, grab a beer, grab some food, well, j g Sports Bar is the place to be. They have so many specials, it's unbelievable. They got $6 lunch specials, and that includes fries and a 20-ounce soda. Basically, you get, like, a Philly cheese, uh, you get Angus Burger, chicken fingers, and pretty much six wings. I recommend the Cajun sauce, because... I like spicy stuff, but that's just me. Uh, Wednesday nights, uh, from 7 p.m. to close, two for one ladies' night, that's uh, Wales beer and wine. Uh, also, what's cool, they have uh, two for 250 cheese slices all day, every day, and they have dollar drafts from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. That's Monday through Friday, and again, that's all day, every day. And what's cool is Monday and Friday, uh, Danny Dowd with Lakeside Cornell comes out there to do the Cornell tournaments, and what's cool, that, what's cool about that is the people who participate in those Cornell tournaments get dollar drafts and dollar slices but it's only for the people who are in the tournament so that's what they have to look forward to and if you're a big time poker player come out there Friday nights and Sunday nights uh, on Friday 7pm to close and Sunday 4pm to close and uh, you go out there have, have yourself a nice poker night and Saturday it's uh, 5 for $10 dollar bud, bud Light buckets it's really awesome so j g Sports Bar located on 4976 Millennium Boulevard Orlando, Florida 328 Three, nine. They're open from 11 a.m. to 2 a.m. every day, and you know it's just it's just a great place to be. Jason runs it, and he's a he's a really awesome guy, a really good friend of mine. And and if and if if, if we're going there just to hang out, they got some they have free free Wi-Fi too. So go ahead and bring your laptop in there if you want, uh, iPhone, whatever. But uh, yeah, J and G Sports Bar, best place to be, best pizza in town. Check them out. Girl, sit 
sitting on the deck drinking fishbowl margaritas And a bunch of girls down in Cancun, yes, some seven-day senoritas A bunch of girls packed in a jeep headed to the beach for the weekend And a bunch of girls rocking out in Vegas ain't got no time for sleeping Girls looking for a good time Breaking hearts, turning heads and looking so fine Nothing drives the boys right Welcome back to Mike and the Crew in the Morning um, I still haven't told you what um, that, I haven't told you what we're doing for the uh, open mic segment Because, um, you know, I was going to save it until the music opener um, That was our break um, Let me get this right opened up here Music all right, and uh, yeah. This is something you need to sing. Everybody, wanna come on down? It's time for the open mic. 